All right, take a trip back in time this weekend at the 50th annual Great Oregon Steam Up. It is a working museum full of power equipment and other machines from the past century. Cora Harlan is live showing us some of the machinery on display and some you can even take out for a test ride. And Cora, I know you enjoy things like this. Oh, Jenny, I'll tell you what, Jenny and Ken, uh, I'll tell you arguably, this is maybe my favorite event of the summer here in the Mid-Willamette Valley. We're just off of exit 263 north of Salem in Brooks at the Powerland Heritage Park. We are in the actually the Northwest Vintage Car and Motorcycle Museum, which is part of the park there. They have just a huge assortment of things uh, to look at here. Everything steam powered from 100 years ago, farm equipment. They have a sawmill that they fire up. Uh, they have all sorts of antique tractors and they have a pipe organ here and this fellow sitting in front of me here looks the part with the derby hat and everything connie is over there this is stephen miller on the uh, on the keyboards here fire this thing up just play it a little bit and uh while while stephen is playing there now he says he's just learning how to do this too but that is a real live cool pipe organ uh, that was originally built back in illinois uh, back in 1926, and as Carl kind of whizzles a camera around there, you can see that the, uh, the, the uh, oh, I guess the, uh, the air that blows through a lot of these things, there's about 10 or maybe 10 or 11 different components that this thing works on. This is uh, the, other, the other fellow I wanted to issue here in just a minute is Tom Papelka, who's back here to talk with us a little bit about this. This, I mean, every time I come down here, I just can gawk at all of this stuff, including this pipe organ. This is really yeah. neat. This is the latest addition to it. We've been four years working on this here. It came as a, a package up crate, and we put it together, and the gentleman that had took it out of the building had only an hour or so to take it out, so he just did what he could and got it, he got it out and then says, here you go, guys. This, this is an organ that played in Tillamook for a long time for silent films back in the 20s and 30s. Tillamook right? Theater. Yeah. And uh, somewhere in its life style, it got water on it and a lot of stuff mildewed and rusted and we've had to clean it all up. Now, this operates off of uh, uh, something that a blower back yeah. there, a main blower, right? Horsepower blower back in that sound kind of sound Steven, you're pretty good for just getting the hang of this, huh? You need somebody to turn your pages a little quicker, but uh, yeah, you're on fire here. So that blower then uh, through a series of uh, what's looked to be simple HVAC pipes. ducting, right? Pipes, yeah, HVAC pipes. And then it goes down to a regulator that sets the pressure on, on everything. Let's go back here and look at this. Follow me back here. Carl, I'll, I'll just have you come back here with us here. They're getting set up. The show starts this weekend, but look at all these different things here. These are these are really cool to stand here and look at this. It's, it's, it's fun. Everybody likes to see the moving parts. That's why it's down. And usually you go into a theater or something and it's covered up and you don't see it. And we put it out so people can say, hey, that's what's inside an organ. Yeah. I mean, there is a there is a gee whiz factor and a oh wow factor. Every corner you turn at this event, it is for the next two weekends down here in Brooks, Oregon, which again is just north of Salem here this weekend, Saturday and Sunday, the following weekend after that, the end of the month as well. So it's a two weekend show, four days in all, if you don't have uh, time to get out here this weekend. This is just uh, this is just scratching the surface of this thing too. A lot of folks like coming out here. Do that. People love coming out and seeing all this. It's fun to see the tractors when they're doing their thing, and when they, cut, they get the sawmill running, watch them cut up lumber, dimensional for houses, and everything like that. All of our all of our lumber in our buildings that's dimension, we make it on site, and then it, the, the inspector comes out and grades it for us. Pretty awesome, pretty awesome. They're dressed in some of the antique clothing too, Jenny and Ken. You know about the Powerland Heritage Park down here if you haven't heard of it before, and I can't imagine anybody hasn't by now. Come on out and check this out because there is tons of cool stuff like this. Very good, Stephen, good job. Take a bow, stand up and take a bow in that derby hat, Jenny and Ken. That's Stephen Miller on the pipe organ this morning from the Powerland Heritage Park. It's Social Security Day, so everybody's going to go out and get some breakfast after this. It's a good day, and you're a heck of a good organ player, man. Hey. That's it. For, for somebody who's just learning this, you're doing pretty good. He's doing a pretty good job, right? Yeah. yeah. I, you seem like you're from this era, like you're in the wrong time. Yeah, I mean, period. this is your element, Core. Yeah. You really mm -hmm. feel comfortable. 
Oh, yeah. All of us antiques here. I think that's what they're calling all of us antiques. I, yeah. get, I get included in that list now. Yeah, I <laughs> I would agree with that. Yeah, good stuff. <laughs> yeah, and there are, you know, and I'm sure all the people there can uh, really tell you stories about those contraptions and how they're used and yeah. how they're maintained and all mm -hmm. of that. So some yeah. history lessons out there as well. Yep. That's I want to see the it, lumber right? being cut. That would be cool. Yeah. Yeah, I think I've seen that before. Yeah. Uh, mm -hmm. I think Cora has cut some uh, logs out there before. I'm sure in he the has. Past. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Let's take a look at our uh, weather forecast right now. And if people head down to Brooks to check that out, uh, probably a few days from now, the weather will be similar to what it is now. <laughs> That's right. Not much change in our yeah. forecast. Just uh, gorgeous summer weather continues. So down to